Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the program uh, Karen Rontowski. Oh my God. Thank you so much. It is so nice to be here today. I tell you, my kids were so bad in Walmart. I actually pulled a fly swatter off the shelf and I spanked them. <laughs> and just as the fly swatter hit their ass, I thought, I don't have kids. <laughs> I don't have kids, I'm single. The other night I went out with a guy, said he didn't like women who were fragile or vulnerable. So I stabbed him. I think he'll call again. See, because I like to be different. I like to think outside the box. For example, I celebrate Halloween in August, because when you show up at someone's house at night wearing a mask in August, you get better stuff. <laughs> See, think outside the box. I only wear underwear with little pictures of Santa Claus on them, because then, no matter what mood I'm in, I always know it's Christmas in my pants. <laughs> And I never wear a cowboy hat because that makes me look like an old stripper that doesn't know it's over. <laughs> and I was just in Reno, Nevada. Oh my God, it was so exciting when I was there. The police went on the news. They were looking for a woman who had stolen a baby out of the hospital. And they described her as being over 400 pounds and wearing hot pink stretch pants. <laughs> And immediately, my heart went out to the pants. <laughs> and then I got thinking, maybe she's a criminal genius. 400 pounds in hot pink stretch pants? Who'd notice a baby? <laughs> And my parents, they just came out to visit me, you know, for a month. Oh yes, the people that gave me life came to suck it right back out of me. <laughs> Trying to kill me one visit at a time. They're nuts. My dad told me he put a drawbridge on his house. Just turns out he installed the garage door upside down. <laughs> a little girl, you know, my dad, he would give me advice. He would say, Karen, always be proud of yourself. Always be proud of yourself because no matter what you do, there's always going to be some jerk standing there cutting you down. That's just how your mother is. <laughs> my parents hate each other. I don't know why they're still married. I told my mother she wasn't thinking positive. So she joined a widow's club. <laughs> and we're a very nervous family. Our family crest is a picture of an irritable bowel. <laughs> and my parents hate my other job. I work part time as a ghost hunter. And people come up to me all the time. They say, Karen, can you teach me how to ghost hunt? And I tell them, it's very easy. You go to a haunted place, and you turn on a tape recorder, and you have the same conversation that married people have during sex. You say, can you make some noise so I know you're here? <laughs> Very 
nice. Thank you so much. I understand it's Christmas in your pants. Yeah. You're a very lucky woman. <laughs> uh, we'll be right back with Anne-Sophie Moot.